Hello, I'm Helen from the Writing Development Centre. If you're joining us as a new first year, then we've met before in the university's online induction course. But now that teaching starting for real in the first week of this rather unusual academic year, I just wanted to check in with you again and talk a little bit about the ongoing process of transition throughout your first term and in fact the whole of your first year. The WDC team, along with our library colleagues, were there in week three of the online induction course to give you a bit of a heads up about what university study is going to be like and the kinds of academic skills you'll be developing, just enough to get you started. When our term's begun, you'll be getting some real experience about what teaching, learning and assessment are like in your subject, so you can start developing those academic skills for real in context, which is where they make most sense after all. Those skills take time to develop and refine, and your approach will continue to evolve throughout your whole degree. Induction might be over, but the transition to university study is a much longer process of learning and developing your understanding of the how to student. I'm sure you're feeling ready to start your studies, but I wanted to reassure you that you're not expected to be oven ready and fully fledged at this point, a fully formed student, before things have even got going. Learning to learn and figuring out how to succeed in your assessments is a complex and ongoing process. You're learning how to think, act and communicate in very new, very different ways. Academic writing is no one's native language, we say, and you'll become fluent in time. So throughout your whole first year, you'll be getting opportunities to practice and develop your academic skills in your assignments with feedback from your lecturers to help you improve. And that's what your first year is for, after all. The Writing Development Centre will be here throughout your whole degree to help you figure out those study skills and you're welcome to get in touch with us anytime. We'll be here for you throughout your first university assignment and afterwards to help you make sense of the feedback and put it into practice in your second assignment and so on. We'll be around if you want to look at how to organise your studies effectively and deal with any challenges that come up for you. That first term can be pretty full on and hectic at the best of times. And at the moment, we're all dealing with additional challenges like during the COVID pandemic. So if you want to talk about any other aspect of your study skills, like getting the most of online teaching or how to keep motivated and organised with your studies, you can talk that through with one of our tutors too if you want. You could book a confidential one-to-one -one tutorial with one of us where you can talk about your studies and how to approach them with new strategies and techniques for a whole 50 minutes just to focus on you and your academic development. The best time to set up an appointment is once you've got stuck into your studies. So you've got a bit of experience under your belt. You know what the specific questions are that you need to ask us and we can tell you our guidance to your particular context rather than just giving you vague generic advice. But don't feel that you have to have a finished draft of a piece of work to make an appointment with us. If you're stuck with something, no matter what stage it's at, that's the time that you need to come and have a chat with us. We're also busily creating a new range of online resources with lots of advice and tips. Check out our website where you'll find our blog, our YouTube channel and links to other resources. And we'll keep creating things throughout the whole academic year. If there's anything particular that you're after, we'd love to hear from you. Um, our You Ask the WDC video series on YouTube is our Academic Agony Ant column where we answer your study skills questions. So if you have a particular question for us, do get in contact. You might also be seeing some of our materials embedded in your course by your lecturers. So watch out for those too. So as I say, induction might be over, but your transition to becoming a university student is only just beginning. And the WDC will be here for you throughout. We call it scaffolding. Bit by bit, we'll be here to help you to build up your skills and confidence until you're a successful independent learner. So from me and the rest of the WDC team, we're wishing you all the best for your first term at Newcastle.